As we head into the month of December, the last month of the year 2021, um, I want to wish everybody uh, good holidays and happy cheer as much as you can manage to muster in these times. Uh, one of the more important events of uh, December is an eclipse uh, of the sun in the middle part of Sagittarius, the Aries part of Sagittarius, suggesting that now is a very good opportunity for all of us, you and I, and hopefully the leaders of the world, to take on a new direction with regard to how we see ourselves on the planet. Um, perhaps of some assistance, is a comet that's going to be visible in the early uh, days of December that uh, entered our solar system somewhere around January 3rd of uh, 2021. And on January 20, the 3rd of uh, 2022, uh, it will be exactly opposite the uh, sun of the United States. So these kind of uh, commentary entries, especially one like this, which is coming and leaving forever, really portends possibly a real deep spiritual message that it might be time for the world to wake up and change direction. Here's the chart for the month of December 2021, which has a Sagittarius sun and rising with a Scorpio moon. This is a situation filled with the consequences of inaction and infighting. This balsamic moon seeks release from the past and is focused on the future. The Moon's first contact is with Mars as the solar lunar cycle comes to an end in a solar eclipse on December 4th, leaving undone the need for action, igniting a stronger desire for a new direction. Finding more positive directions is important for each of us in this time of uncertainty. With Neptune moving forward again, it is time for spiritual growth. A little spiritual invention may be in order, as comment Leonard, which last January 3rd came into the solar system and is now nearing an opposition to the natal sun of the United States. The comet will leave the solar system forever on January 3rd, 2022. It seems to be a message for world leaders to quit hiding behind wars and economic dominance and respond to the need for a higher, more spiritual calling. If you know your moon and rising signs, uh, listen to those as well. Aries, fight off your insecurities and meet value challenges which can increase your self-worth. The result of your efforts will bring greater independence. Minimize fears and move forward. Taurus, your life is experiencing a slow but steady transformation. What is needed is to resolve inner conflict about your sense of self-worth. That is the focus of the change needed. Gemini, perhaps you are conflicted concerning your self-worth. The real need is to rise above common social norms and express yourself with a sense of validity that can overcome self-doubt. Cancer, this is a time of new starts and new directions. Try to strengthen faith in yourself and your creative abilities. Your life is rooted in believing in your ability to create your own future. Leo, to be in control of your life, you need to revive your sense of social self-worth. Pretending will fail because you need to actually have enough faith in your ability in order to control your future. Virgo, recycle your mental attitude toward being more daring and rise above self-doubt. What hides within your mind behind those doubts is your power and creative ability. Let life happen. Libra, the way forward demands a significant degree of healing and a strong need for reviving your personal independence. This means truth-telling and the overcoming of depressed feelings. Scorpio, take a deep, very private dive into your feelings and you will find much validity to the idea that you must leave your past behind while also repurposing it 
as a source of your strength. Sagittarius, your challenge to overcome fear of failure and to express new, higher, more transformative values. This presents challenges to resolve inner conflicts about your relationships. Capricorn, your leader, Saturn, is charging ahead with breakthroughs in your world. How are you going to keep up with this process of transformation if you remain captive to past traumas? Aquarius, change everything by rooting out all non-essentials that hinder your financial growth. This means responding to the need to reorient yourself toward resolving your own inner conflicts. Pisces, feeling like your back is to the wall, only you are the wall. Your real need is to overcome self-doubt. Focus on your inner life as that is where you can truly resolve conflicted value sense. Now, in the socio-economic political arena, these are truly revolutionary times. With Saturn and Uranus square, ever since June 14th of 2021. The need for reorientation of personal and national life toward the future strongly called for and focused on the economy as the world's dominant economic system struggles with the effects of the pandemic. Since the moon will join Mars in Scorpio, there is a real possibility that secrets of the past may come to light. The eclipse on the 4th of December is in President Joe Biden's first house, explaining why his presidency is afflicted with infighting he will have to find a new direction for his leadership to be effective. The solar eclipse in Sagittarius on December 4th offers another chance to make meaningful changes in leadership goals, the direction of the country, and to the dependence on a planet-wide socio-economic system which has brought the planet to the edges of oblivion. This is the last eclipse in the Sagittarius series of eclipses until 2030. It offers a chance to do something new, and it also sets a time limit for action. What we do between now and November of 2030 will largely determine the fate of the Earth and life as we know it.